We all want a pet that's easy on the eyes, so dogs and cats are a go-to. However, have you ever wondered what it would be like to be an exotic pet owner? Luckily, there are options to have the best of both worlds, such as this adorable primate and this cute and teeny pig. Let's list some of your other options, beginning with Meerkat. What better cute exotic animal to start the list than the meerkat, a small mongoose native in South Africa that many people might find easy to recall as a star cast of the classic children's film, The Lion King. These slender, furry animals grow no bigger than 14 inches, along with their tail that can grow almost the same length. They are also light, tameable, and easy to feed, ideal characteristics of an at-home pet. In the wild, they eat scorpions, small reptiles, and mostly insects. In a roster of desert dwellers, they'll be hard to miss, especially when they do their iconic stance, where they stand upright on their hind legs while their paws lay dangling on their tummies. If you want one as a pet, be sure to prepare a habitat reminiscent of their natural one. These carnivores like digging in the sand and creating burrows. They are also very social creatures, so you will want to keep more than one. Although, that wouldn't be hard. One good look at their pointed snouts and inquisitive eyes, and you'll want to keep more than one for sure. Axolotl. Who would think that a fish with legs could look this cute? Except those aren't fish, but are aquatic salamanders called axolotls. They are also critically endangered, so owning one automatically makes you an exotic pet owner. They are carnivores that commonly eat earthworms, shrimp, and small fish, among others. Many dream of owning this water puppy, and it's easy to figure out why. Just look at how dreamy it looks, all pink, with their exposed gills flapping about, looking like they're smiling all the time. Axolotls can reach lengths of up to 10 inches. They can also live up to 15 years with the right care and maintenance. It's important to invest in the best equipment from the get-go. They're not a very common first choice when one asks for aquarium pets. However, that doesn't make them less popular as a choice of pets. They can be sensitive and high maintenance, but what's a little effort if you get to look at them flounder about with their cute fins and legs? Bearded Dragon. For those who are more into reptiles, this entry is for you. Bearded dragons are small caricatures of their namesake, characterized by the beard of spiny scales it shows off from under its chin. They are originally from the deserts of Central Australia, where they scare off their predators by puffing up their spikes. Because they easily tolerate getting handled and are very tame to humans, they are the most popular choice of pets among reptiles. They are active during the day, and are even recorded as having gestures directed towards their pet owners, suggesting an attempt to communicate. What cute, intelligent beings. Bearded dragons can grow to lengths of up to 24 inches, a good chunk of that being their majestic tail, which also features beautiful spikes. With the proper care and tending, these lizards can live for up to 12 years. They are kept in tanks at home and are omnivorous, so are fed with live insects or packed feeds that can be bought from pet shops. Because they are fairly common, your local pet stores might have their necessities in the ready. Slow Loris. It's easy to lose time looking at these very entrancing eyes. This is a slow Loris, a nocturnal primate originally from South and Southeast Asia that catches the interest of primate pet enthusiasts. These primates are on the smaller side of the family, with their head plus body lengths, ranging between 7 to 15 inches. Their cuteness can be attributed to their stout body shape, their hands and feet evolved for them to easily hang on branches for long periods. They are social creatures, but are also territorial. Common folk and scientists alike take an interest in this fascinating animal most particularly on the fact that these cute creatures are surprisingly packed with flesh-rotting venom, the only one of the kind that has it. So that's a huge consideration if you want to keep them in your home. Because of that, experts do not recommend keeping them as pets and attempting to domesticate them at all. They are also endangered due to poaching and habitat loss, and their numbers in the wild continue to dwindle. Ball Python 
Having scales doesn't deter snake lovers from keeping ball pythons as pets. Snakes don't get the best rep from scary films, but with the right knowledge, you'll realize they're not that intimidating. Ball pythons are one of the most popular snakes to keep as pets. Owners like holding them in their hands when they curl into a ball as they don't bite as much as other species do. Instead, they keep their necks and snouts tucked away. They also like to burrow like they do in the wild to attempt to hide from predators. So you'll want them to have something like that in their enclosure. Ball pythons eat small mammals and birds, with rodents being the staple in their diet. They start cute and easy to handle, but ball pythons can reach lifespans of 30 years, with adults growing up to 5 feet long. At that point, their enclosures can get large and spacious to accommodate their build. You also must be mindful when it's time for them to shed. They can get irritable and hostile, so pay attention. Mini Pig Mini pigs, micro pigs, teacup pigs, pocket pigs, whatever you call them, have surged in popularity in recent years. They perpetually look like newborn pigs, which is great, because nobody thinks piglets aren't cute. They don't have a distinct breed, but are all just small breeds of a variety of domesticated pig species. Their most common features are their chubby figure, short snout, indistinguishable neck, shorter legs, and their characteristic pot belly. Their ideal weight is between 45 to 200 pounds, which can be difficult to maintain if you can't help but feed their cute faces. In nature, pigs are curious, affectionate, and surprisingly intelligent animals. So owning a small manageable one within your home just like a house dog sounds like an excellent idea. However, experts warn that keeping and taking care of them is not that easy. Because they are like average breeds, just built small, owners will have to be strict in regulating their food. Also, pigs are more prone to carrying diseases that can be contracted by humans, making their presence in a living space a hazard. They require serious commitment and research. With the right care, these babies can live from 15 to 20 years. Chinchilla They look like smiling fluff balls. Chinchillas are medium-sized rodents that are among the most owned exotic pets. Historically, they've been bred for their exquisitely soft and dense fur that does not smell bad that easily. They are naturally very hygienic animals that don't smell, making them good house pets. Their bodies are long and grow up to 14 inches, while their fluffy bushy tails grow up to 6 inches. In the wild, they live in mountain habitats along the Andes Mountains, with colonies that could number up to over 100 chinchillas. Their build can be deceiving, but because of their natural habitat, these surprisingly athletic rodents are capable of leaping heights that reach over 6 feet. Talk about the unexpected. Their diet consists of high-fiber food. This not only helps with their digestion, but also their teeth that grow fast. They gnaw on hay to encourage its wear and tear. They are also nocturnal, so don't disturb your pet chinchillas in the morning. Their maintenance is a lot simpler compared to the other exotic animals on this list, but also still needs special attention. Their very dense fur can trap fungi and deadly bacteria when wet, so they don't bathe in the usual sense. Instead of water, they roll themselves in dust, effectively keeping themselves clean and free from dirt. Fennec Fox A common character in children's tales is the cunning fox. And yet, that stereotype hasn't stopped people from fantasizing about keeping one in their home. Meet the Fennec Fox, the cunning fox's friendlier relative. It's the smallest of its kind, hailing from dry habitats in North Africa. These nocturnal omnivores are easily distinguishable by their huge ears. These bat-like ears help them hunt their prey in the dark and can even hear for burrowing prey in the sand. Once detected, they dig with all four feet for their meal. The ears also help alert themselves from dangers as they burrow in their self-dug underground dens. These adorable foxes are sought after as pets because of their demure character. Their length only reaches 16 inches, plus another 10 for their tail. They also don't weigh a lot, hence are easy to control and carry in homes. Their diet mostly consists of fat insects, 
with the most common in the desert being grasshoppers and locusts, but they also consume plants, particularly fruits and leaves. In the desert where water is scarce, they rely on vegetation to hydrate. Sand Cat Another desert dweller makes it to this list, and this time, it's from the feline family. The sand cat took the internet by storm when their kittens were photographed for the first time in the wild. These very elusive cats are native to Asia and Africa and are adapted to live in an arid environment. They grow up to 20 inches in body length, their tails up to 12 inches, and their maximum height not going beyond 12 inches. That's a build not too far from the common house cat. Their coloring helps them camouflage in the wild, and their long, dense hairs keep their souls from burning from the hot sands. As with other desert predators, the sand cat is nocturnal and greatly relies on its strong senses to hunt for prey in the dark. They keep themselves safe and out of sight by living in burrows. They've unfortunately become victims of the illegal pet trade, so there are now recent efforts to handle their conservation. Because of their wild nature, not a lot of people keep them as captive pets. Sugar Glider The cutest exotic animal you can own that tops this list is none other than the Sugar Glider. People have only begun domesticating them in the last 15 years, but they have become very popular exotic house pets. These cute gliding possums can fit right in your hands, as their length from nose to tail goes only as long as 12 inches. They have soft, fluffy fur with colors that range from gray to brown and have flaps of skin that help them glide. In their natural habitats, sugar gliders jump from tree to tree with their arms with skins stretched as far as they can. Well cared for, domesticated sugar gliders can live up to 15 years. Their diet consists mostly of sweet food, hence the name. It includes pollen, sap, nectar, and the occasional beetles. They are also social animals that bond with their kind, but also with their human owners. Just like every other exotic pet, these cute marsupials require their unique care. They are picky with their chosen diet, so look out during their mealtimes. Also, they can get lonely and sensitive, so it's ideal to own another for their company. See you all next time.